cable car systems have become a new, tangible urban transportation option. Today, ropeways are used to improve mobility conditions and can be seen in many cities across the world. The first cable-propelled transit systems have been developed in Latin American cities, like in La Paz, where the systems are fully integrated in the public transport networks. New systems are also operated in Europe and in Asia. The Asian Development Bank supports its member countries in developing sustainable urban mobility systems. Consistent with the international agreements and as the transport sector is to accelerate its decarbonization in Asia and Pacific region, cable solutions have a great potential to help enable the shift to public transport and to electric modes. The Government of India sees a great potential in urban cable car solutions and requested the support of the ADB and its partners. The study tour is organized in the context of an ADB loan and project readiness financing facility for the city of Aizal and the National Ropeway Development Program spearheaded by the Government of India. This program aims at developing over 250 ropeways projects nationwide within five years. For cities in India, urban cable car has the potential not only to promote tourism, but also to serve as a viable option for urban public transport. Under IZAL's Sustainable Urban Transport Project, a comprehensive mobility plan has been developed and an urban cable car solution is proposed. Uh, Ropeway sector is a nascent sector in India and uh, uh, in 2022-23 it was announced to, to uh, basically uh, develop uh, last mile connectivity for the you know, uh, hilly stations in India uh, or the uh, places which are not uh, accessible. So uh, a 60 kilometer development of ropeways was announced and accordingly uh, the first project in that uh, Parvatmala Pariyojana uh, we have uh, taken as Varanasi, which is the first urban ropeway uh, project in India. The study tour was organized jointly with the ADB, the French Development Agency, AFD, and the Mobilize Your City, MYC, Asia program, of which IZOL became a member city in 2024. The study tour included site visits and meetings with stakeholders involved in two major projects in France. The Telio Cable Car Project in Toulouse, under operation since 2022, and the C1 Cable Car Project in the Greater Paris region, commissioning in 2025. The delegation met with the public transport authorities, manufacturers, engineers, operators, and the certification body of cable car projects for in-depth project discussions, exchanges, and both ways learning. For a hilly city like Aizol, it will ease the transportation problem that we are facing with regard to cost and time. And uh, as a working mother myself, we have uh, many women supporting their children and their family in Mizoram. And for them, it will be really useful with regard to the uh, cost and time. So important to uh, integrate, make, make that integrated planning. And also this uh, study tour has enabled me to understand what are the kind of technologies available uh, in, the, in the cable car system. Uh, so what kind of alternatives which we can have depending on the place depending on the availability of land and also it helps me understanding how decisions are taken how uh, stake stakeholders are involved how stakeholders are being uh, are being uh, kept in the loop in the decision making process from the various meetings some of the key factors for success could be as follows one sound planning and studies as for all public transport system two stakeholder engagement and consultations particularly needed for new system three, selection of adequate cable technology, four, integration with other public transport modes and universal accessibility, five, project concept developed by independent ropeway experts, and six, the importance of branding and events. We see great potential in cities across Asia and the Pacific to use cable solutions to improve mobility conditions and access.